Have you ever wondered how Minecraft Bedrock spawns mobs? Everything you need to know can be split into three categories, the suitable location, the mob cap, and the spawning process. Today, we're gonna to take a dive into the mob cap. And by the mob cap, I mean mob caps because there's three of them. The first one is the global cap. The global cap is in charge of making sure there is no more than 200 spawn mobs at one time. This only counts naturally spawned mobs. The second cap is the population control cap. This cap is in charge of making sure there's not too many mobs of a certain type within a nine by nine square chunk centered around the selected spawn location. The types of mobs include ambient, animal, monster, pillager, and water animals. Each of these types are also split into surface and cave spawns, which is designated during the spawning process. The final mob cap is the mob density cap. This cap is very similar to the population control cap, but is pertaining to each individual mob instead. This cap is also split into surface versus cave spawns and stops mobs from spawning where they don't belong, or that there's not too many of one particular mob.